G'day viewers, I'm just putting along behind this truck here, so I thought I'd take this opportunity to say g'day. So today I'm just going for a little putt out uh, west here, going to meet a mate for lunch and see what's what. So someone asked me the other day when I was getting Buddy's little uh, tray I, bought, I bought, made to put in there, they say what do you keep under the seat? So. When I get home, I'll make a little uh, video of how, what I keep under the seat. And you can tell me if I'm carrying unnecessary things under there or if you've got any other ideas. It's always interesting to see what other people carry under the seat. Obviously, there's tools in there. Uh, we'll see what else <laughs> is in there. What other unnecessary things I've got un in there? Oh, this guy's slower than me. What's going on? Okay, hey, well, I'm going to pull in here and have some lunch viewers, so I will see you later and I'll show you what is in the uh, space under the seat. My settlers at Mulgoa. Looks like a nice spot for some lunch. Customer parking only. Oh, it looks like someone's Ducati that I know. Oh, you're over there. There they are. And you can compare it to yours. All right, so there we go. You can okay. there go. see what's there. So what's what? have a look so we've obviously got the tool kit and I'll have a look at the tool kit now I've got a uh, well there's some uh, spare fuses I need to chuck those in the bag in the back I bought myself some fancy tire levers and there's a big uh, allen key in here which I need to get one of the wheels off so there's a big allen key I don't know what size it is, I think it's an imperial size that I need to get uh, one of the wheels off. I can't remember, I pulled all three wheels off, so that's just shoved in there with the tools. I have a spare tube, just in case I have trouble changing a wheel or something, but uh, sometimes I worry that it might be easier to change a tube than the wheel. And then in here, in the pink bag, I have a tiny... Tiny little jack. Okay, so the jack is pretty small and uh, it doesn't reach up to there. Alright, so it's got a. Uh, comes with a lever. The jack is obviously, it's not going to be high enough to get up to there. Okay, so in the boot, I have my uh, bit of wood, like so, and I use this to get the back wheel back wheel up on the sidecar uh, with the bike up on the uh, side stand center stand so that's what I use that for so I carry this chunk of wood in the back which I use to put the bike up on its center stand and then I can just stick, stick that on the bit of wood and up it goes and there we go Stop looking at me. Get you with the camera. Yeah, I'll get you. Bits of foam here. I think it's a draw liner or something. Put that in there to stop things bouncing around. I've got one on the other side, so if the jack is in there, it fits there nicely and it doesn't doesn't bounce around. That that is what's under the seat. Got a few extra tools in the tool bag, but that's uh, nothing, nothing exciting there. Oh, I use this chunk of wood. Okay. 
Then, what have I got in the boot? Just a quick look. I've got a hat, sponsored by Heineken. Thank you very much. Uh, I've got an old oily rag. I've got another little section of Max tracks, an old hockey strap in my bag. I've got a bag full of full of stuff in here. Mask, sign of the times. Bog roll, just in case. Sunscreen, it's summertime. Uh, a funnel for filling up the si uh, petrol. Um, that's the key to the boot. So I keep the key to the boot in there, so I've always got it. What I've got in here is cables and all sorts of little bits and pieces. Uh, charging cable, bumper cable. Uh, in there, in here, I've got a compressor and a multimeter and puncture repair kit. So that's always, that goes on either bike. And charging cable for a phone or oh, a little hammer. I think I need that to get one of the wheels off or something, I think. So I've got a little hammer, a little soft mallet, and charging thing. That should go in the other bag. And my new addition is my gombo saw. So this is a... So I've always got something that will uh, get me out of trouble if there's a branch across the... The road that's that's really sharp so that's a bit of a bit of a weapon so I keep that in there now too and it just packs away like that so that's it that's what's in that's what I'm carrying around probably too much stuff and that cable oh, I'll just leave it loose in there so that bag's just got bits and pieces that I always have with me Bog roll, very important in the bush. Mask if you go into a servo these days, and sunscreen because it's summer. That gives me a bit of room left over. There we go. Okay, say goodbye, viewers. <laughs> All right, mate, I'll see you next time. Phone connected. Recording. Oh, well, look, the sun's out now, viewers, so there won't be any rain on me this Arvo heading home. So I just had a good lunch. So, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Into a tent. Okay, bye for now.